First off, we I think we already kind of talked about this with CMHC changing its lending options for multi-res housing. We touched on that last time. The final things haven't come out yet. They haven't dotted their I's and crossed their T's yet. But it, we are bigly, big saying that this is going to become one of the biggest. I'm running out of words. Bigly. Bigly. Heard it. We're bigly saying that this is going to become one Trump of the biggest supporter. housing booms. <laughs> 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 one of the biggest housing construction booms, or at least multi-res It's in going apartments. to be insane. Yeah. This it is, is going to be an arms race. There's also going to be a big rush on land. And there, big rush on I land. think the rush on land is taking place because a lot of yeah. the developers have yeah, been know. tipped yeah. off by their bankers that this is coming. Yeah. Um, and they're, they'll keep a keen pulse. And if you, for me, I've felt it in the last three, four months, my developer clients, my land purchasers went from like wanting land mm-hmm. to desperately wanting land, like quite yeah. aggressively. And the bid prices and also the neighborhoods we were looking in, like originally, okay, only downtown cores. Now it's like, oh, peripheral? Is there an ability to build apartments? Sure, I'll take it. And I'm like, there was also a big difference because for a while it was like they were all they all wanted a deal, right? Like, yeah. oh, you know, these are trading at 15 a unit. Um, you know, I'd like to get it 12. 13 or 12. <laughs> yeah. Because back then the unit might have cost, you know, 180 to, to build. So the difference yeah. between 15 and 12 percentage wise was a bit bigger. Now yeah. the units cost so much more and they're going up so quickly that they're like, they're oh, trades for, for 15, land. I'll give 17. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's craziness. Uh-huh. So that's going to be huge, huge news. If you think there's a lot of buildings being put up now, you just wait. You wait until that that comes down. So, But that's what we need, right? So CMHC heard the message of, oh, our existing programs do not work. So this program, it's, it's not going to be qualification-based, or it's not going to be um, application-based. It's you meet the criteria, boom, you get it, period. Where some of their other programs in the past was, oh, you meet the criteria, great, line up with all these other people, and we're going to approve one in five of you. Yeah, that's right? the um, So th- this is going to be great. Um, the other thing that's huge is we are now the officially the fastest growing city in Canada. That's insane. Central Halifax. For all Halifax listeners. Yep. Not price wise, but people wise. And yeah, downtown core of Halifax has been is going to yeah. be the fastest growing. Um, is that on a density scale? Yeah, yeah, something like that. Yeah, per per square kilometer. Um, so yeah, that that is super exciting. In general, I think the other tops were still TO Vancouver, Calgary was growing quite a bit too. I think. I'm not sure if I saw that rolling around Instagram, but Calgary had quite a bit of growth. Um, but yeah, that's good. Thanks for watching that clip from the Master Keys podcast. Check out that full episode here. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share our podcast. When, 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 when I was broke, I had rich habits. Uh. When I was broke, I had rich habits. Uh.